Mellow greetings, Mary Tubians. Welcome to a new series on the channel. We are going to be playing the original Rune Factory for the DS. Um, I am capturing this on a modified 3DS, and you might wonder why I've got the screens backwards. I had the bottom screen in the big section, and that's because this game plays with the top screen being used for sort of a map, um, and the bottom screen is where all the action happens. Uh, of course, I'll have to cut all of the audio for this section out, Brandon. Please remember that. Shouldn't be too hard. Fairly easy. We can do that. Uh, so this is where the Room Factory series began. Um, now, I picked up this copy of the game... Oh, a very, very, very long time ago. <laughs> um, and I've never played more than a couple of days into it. Um, I apologise if it's a little bit grainy and it's just because of the way that the capture runs. Um, unfortunately I'm not allowed to capture from emulator in Australia so I'll do what I can to clean it up but we've got to deal with what we've got. And I'm very 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 excited to be playing this game. As I said I've, I've, I think I've played two to three days into it just to make sure the cartridge worked and then it got put onto the backlog along with everything else because that's what happens when you have too many games to play. Um, but with the recent announcement of uh, Rune Factory Guardians of Zuma, I would like to get as many of the other Rune Factories up on channel and play through before I get to that one. Um, so yeah, hopefully it'll be a bit of fun. We'll get to see where the series began and carry forward. Uh, I don't know how far we'll get through the series before Guardians of Azuma drops. We don't actually have a release date for that yet. Although I do have it pre-ordered for my Switch. Kinda hoping, kinda hoping that it'll drop fairly early in the year. Or maybe that Natsume slash Marvelous somebody will announce a remake of the first two, at which point I'd switch it over to playing on Switch. Oh, it is so nice to see the little anime movies were there from the start. This is just... Oh wait, do we only have one love interest? We've only seen one young lady thus far. Oh, we're growing a tree. Why not tree is sort of the theme of three? Maybe that gets carried forward. Um, I've got no idea how this is going to play or what's different between this and the later titles. I do know that three is seen as sort of the turning point in the series. Oh, there's the rest of our crew. And now the dragon is friendly. Did we have to go pull a thorn out of its paw or something? I guess we'll find out. Rune Factory. Rune Factory, a fantasy harvest moon. You see, I don't even have a save here. I deleted them all. Kingdom of Nora, far east region, outside the town of Cardia. Month of spring, day one, holiday. Early morning. Phew. Oof. All right, we've got the voice acting right Phew. from the start. Phew. Ah, ah, I can't go on. Splat. Are you okay? Wow, I've never seen anyone actually on the verge of collapsing before. I have little sticks for legs. Huh? Well, I've been walking for days with no food, no water. Oh, that's not healthy. Hold on a sec. Where are your outfit, Moon Factory 5? Got it. Here, you can have my hoe. Thank you, I guess. I don't know how that's going to help me. Actually, I was hoping for some water. Oh, right. Water. 
Okay, just wait one moment. Got it. Here you go. Try this watering can. Can I can I drink from it? Um is there something else that you need? I meant some drinking water. Oh, duh. Oh, sorry. It's just the way you're looking all like. I thought a hoe and a watering can would be more your style. Uh. Okay, I'll be right back. Got it. Here you go. Some water and bread. Finally, thank you. Thank you're not you the brightest much. bulb. Thank you. You saved my life. Oh, it's nothing. Say, you're not from this town, are you? Are, are you on a trip or something? Well, to be honest, I don't really know myself, because I'm the main protagonist of a Rune Factory game, therefore I am amnesiac. What do you mean you don't know? I don't remember where I was before coming here. I don't even know who I am. You mean, you have amnesia? Maybe? Do you remember your name? No. Well, everyone needs a name. That's true. Why don't you pick one right now? Okay. What shall we call ourselves? Um. Let's see. Armor, a fighter, a brunette with blue eyes. Um, what's going to be a good name for you? How about... We go... Marco. Marco, I like it. You do? Thanks. What's your name, by the way? Oh, my name is Mist. Say, Marco, what are you going to do now? I'm trying to find an inhabited town. I haven't thought past that part yet. In that case, I have an empty house and a field you can use. I don't know what to say, but no, I, I couldn't possibly. Don't be silly, I'm not using them anyway. Besides, I meant what I said before. I think you look like a farmer, Marco. Do, do you really think I have what it takes to work a farm? I, I guess you'll be alright. Um, well... I think you have talent. You've known me for all of three seconds. Okay. Oh, this is going to be so fun. Come on, the house and the field are to the north. You people really take advantage of these amnesiacs for free labor, don't you? Alright. So B is our hoe. I don't know how to run, or even if I get a run button. X is not currently assigned. A is interact. This is my home and farm. What do you think? No, too bad, eh? Yeah, but I'm not asking you to let me work on the land here or anything. Don't worry about that. It's better for me to get all the help I can. But, but... This is the field. I've not done any work on it for a while, so it's overgrown. You don't say... <gasps> What? There's a monster here! Step back, mist! You got any kind of weapon? Use the hoe! Press the B button to fight with it! I have to kill a goblin with my hoe? Well, I'm guessing you'll be very well pruned, sir. Get my lines right. Ah, oh, this takes doing. Is the hoe enchanted with the, what's the returning spell? Whew, I managed to defeat it. Are you okay, miss? Yeah, I'm okay. What about you, Marco? I'm also okay, but I think I killed the monster. No, it's still alive. What? Weapons and tools have a kind of magic called returning. Yep, there we go. Returning? It's a kind of magic that sends monsters back to their origin place. Original place? Monsters are kind of a spirit. 
They originally came from a different world from ours. It looked like its soul went to heaven, but in fact it returned to its real homeland, the first forest. Oh, really? Well, well, I'm glad I didn't kill it. Anyway, I was impressed by you there. Did you learn swordsmanship somewhere? I may have, but my memory... Oh, yeah. Yeah. That's beside the point. I want to know what that monster was doing here. Don't they usually appear above ground? There are people called Earthmates who can summon the monsters. Uh, Earthmates? They are people who can hear the Earth's voice. Some of them can communicate with the monsters. Some people in town live with monsters, but this is the first time a fighting monster was summoned. R really? Well, anyway, you saved me. Thank you so much. Now we're even for the break. Hey, it's nothing. Marco, I really owe you for this. No, no really, it was nothing. As a token of my gratitude, I'm going to let you work on the fields here. Really. Uh, okay, alright. So we have we know that we have to agree, because otherwise the game will stop. But... Well, if you insist, thank you very much. You'll work here. I'm so happy. But why are you doing so much for me? I'm not really sure. I feel that you have potential. But potential? Of what? Yeah, I feel that you seem to understand the ways of the earth. Is, is that so? I also feel that while growing vegetables, your memory may come back. Yeah, because carrots solve everything. Oh, really? In that case, I'd be happy to work on the fields for a while. Great, just get out there and get working. Okay. Ask me if there's anything you need to know. How do you plow the fields? How do you grow crops? What are HP and RP? I'm fine for now. How do you plow the fields? That's a good question. It's the first thing you need to know about life on the farm. This will be your field, Mako. Marco. You can see how overgrown it is. After clearing it, you'll need to get to work with a hoe. Stand in front of objects such as stone and wood and weeds and press A to pick them up. Then press the X button to put them in your backpack. Press the A button again to place stones and wood on the field or to get rid of weeds and other objects. Once you've removed all the clutter from the field, you can start working with a hoe. Press the B button to use the hoe. The icon of the item you're using appears at the bottom right of the screen. Press the L and B buttons together to change the item you're holding. That's going to be interesting given how my DS is laid out, but we'll see what happens. Press the B button when you're on the field to begin plowing it. How do you grow vegetables? It's important to remember you can only sow vegetable seeds in plowed areas. First, press L and B buttons together to change the item you're holding from a hoe to seeds. Next, stand on the area of the field that you plowed. Press the B button to sow the seeds. When plowing, remember that you sow seeds in the, in the nine squares around the square you're standing on. Next, water the seeds. Press the L and B buttons together to change the item you're holding to a watering can. Of course, you have to fill the watering can with water to do so. Okay, we've got a pond. You fill it with water here. Stand here and press the B button. You can water 12 squares each time you fill the watering can. After sowing the seeds, you've got to water them. Water them once a day and your crops will grow. Your crops will stop growing if you don't water them, so it's essential to do this every day. Okay, what a HP and RP. Oh, I nearly forgot to tell you. Don't work too hard or you'll collapse. There is a bar on the top left of the screen showing HP and RP. You'll be able to see it after this conversation. RP shows your rune points. They will decrease when you swing a hoe or a sword. Use up all your RP and your HP health points will start to decrease. You will collapse and have to go to hospital when your HP reaches zero. Well, it's okay to collapse when working on your own farm, but you better not do so while in a cave. Why? 
what would happen to me? Well, you're putting your life on the line if you collapse in a cave. I mean it. Be careful. Okay, I I'll remember not to. You need a pass from the mayor to enter the caves, so this doesn't really concern you right now. You recover HP and RP by sleeping in your bed. It's best to get to bed early if you're tired. Anyway, no matter what, you'll automatically fall asleep if you're still up at 6am. You can't work 24 hours. I've got employers who'd say otherwise. Okay, I'm fine for now. Right, I'm going to give you these seeds, Marco. Use them to grow some vegetables. You got radish seed. Yeah, let's give the farm a name. Try and think of something cool. Um, I'm not calling it Mist Farm. What's a good name for our first ever, historically speaking, Rune Factory? Hmm. What should I call it? We shall call it... I'm tempted to just say Tim, but I hear my partner's voice in that one. We shall call it... Okay, alright. It's a bit of a silly name, but that's okay. We are going to call it... The Rainfall Farm. That's a disappointing kind of name. Just kidding. I think it's a great name. Really, I do. Okay, I'll be here at lunchtime tomorrow, so ask me then if there's anything you need to know. Can I have an axe? Please? How about a hammer? Oh, okay, you're not gonna stack? No, no stacking. Alright, I've got to stop pressing B to run. Let's get some herbs going. That up, it's too big. How do I sell all this stuff? Nobody told me that yet. Yeah, no stack. Okay. Well, as ever, we'll start with this top corner. That should give me. Three by three. One, two, three. Yep. Yeah. I'm going to apologize if I'm a little bit awkward on the controls just because I am playing with a 3DS laying flat on my table as sort of using my recording space to watch what's happening. Am I supposed to go into the village today and start meeting people or is that a tomorrow? Alright, uh, L and B. Uh, do I just keep pressing? Ah, there we go. Yay, we have seeds! Uh, L, B. Let's go fill the watering can because I already used some of it. I really hope I find a run button soon. Maybe it's like R or something? Oh, we're using up a lot of RP. That's alright. I know that will change. Just play what we can. Can I sell all of this? Alright. 
I'm going to gather in the herbs and things as much as we can. Oh, there's yellow grass. Get all of our pretty coloured grasses that we can use. Oh, I can walk over the weeds. Alright, that's good. That's going to make life easier. Oh, a bamboo shoot. Can I just pick that up? Or do I need to hit that with my hoe? No, that's just a pick up. Perfect. Any other advantageous? Alright, that's gonna be my house. Little river over there. Oh, maybe if I use no. Yeah, using the stick doesn't make me run either. I don't think I'm supposed to be here yet. Um, right. No interaction with my mailbox. What about with my sailbox? No. Um, is there a northern exit? Oh, what's this? Big blank area. Alright, I suspect that I'm supposed to use that for like barns and stuff. Um, okay, Ooh, that's town. Okay, so town is straight up. Again, I don't know that I'm supposed to be there yet, so let's just go to bed. Because I feel like Mist is going to show me around. Alright, we've got a big old empty house. Lots of different flooring types. Do I actually have a bed? Yes, I do. Good. Oh, and a journal. Perfect. Right in diary. Oh, we did our first save. Do not write in diary. Alright, our calendar. Jean's birthday. Who's Jean? Melody's birthday. Spring festival. Newman's birthday. Russell's birthday. Big cook off. Egg show. Alright, so we've got some stuff coming up, which also means that. Yes, means that we don't have to buy our things. You can draw on the screenshot there. Take a screenshot anywhere by pressing L and select together. You can draw what you like on that screenshot here. Apparently the screenshot that you draw can be exchanged with friends at the strange shell on the beach. Share cool screenshots with your friends. Screenshots could also be taken in this room. Why not try it out? Press the L and the select together. Don't forget it. I'll see you later. Okay, probably not going to use that. I don't think there's any active online functionality at the moment. Alright, so that will be our kitchen eventually. Okay, we've still got RP and it's, judging by the light, still fairly early in the day. Um, so yeah, let's just clear some more fields. Because this doesn't seem to... If I put a rock down here, no, I think that. Uh, yeah. Let's just host more squares. No idea why. Maybe I can dig up treasure? I'm gonna need money. Kinda like the idea of having a second field ready to go. When I can afford some seeds. 
decide to get rid of those three. Now that's left me exactly a three by three in the middle. So that'll give me space for three lots of crops at the moment. Just keeping a very close eye on that RP gauge. Should be able to do this one and that one. Yeah, no injury. Perfect. All right, let's go to bed and see what tomorrow shall bring us. And I'll just save again. Go to bed. And I have had a big day. I collapsed and all, and then I had to fight a monster. Then I learned I was actually intended to be a farmer, apparently. Alright, we got a full everything, still no food. I'm assuming at some point we'll build a kitchen. Oh! Oh, hello, who are you? Who is it? Sorry, I came here unannounced. I heard someone new moved in. My daughter wanted to meet you. You're a sainty coquille, aren't you? Hello, Jasper. What? Daddy, let's go home. It stinks here. Okay, we don't like you. Oh, really? Okay, let's head off. See you later. That was strange. And I somehow turn her around to realizing that I am just secretly all of the awesome. Gotta use the B button, Ronan. Alright, now Mist said that she'd be here at lunchtime. So I'm guessing I'm just meant to fill time in. is fairly slow moving at this. Seems to be about 10 minutes to the minute. That's alright, we, we, um, we're comfortable with a slightly slower time. Oh, okay you also press B to eat whatever you're holding. I kind of don't want to destroy all the weeds because I don't know if I'm going to get like a fertilizer bin or anything like I do in the other one. So I don't want to risk losing out on potentially useful things just because I was over eager but also at some point they're going to need to teach me how to ship stuff. Doesn't look like there is. Oh, we've got a red grass. I don't actually know what Y does yet. Alright, let's go. Alright, we've got a musical change, but we know that this is Miss. Miss house. I don't think it would be appropriate to visit at this hour. At least not till we're better acquainted. It's 8 a.m. I'm gonna go this way. This is where I came from. I also don't want to accidentally run into any monsters or anything while my only weapon is a hoe. What am I supposed to do ahead of lunch? And try and do some forage or something. Maybe find some apple. That's the way down there. Oh. Ah, my cave. Unauthorized entry prohibited. Goodwin, Mayor of Cardia. Ah, my cave climate. Temperate climate favors spring vegetables. Now, why would I need to know what sort of vegetables you favor?
Please tell me you don't have to go fishing too much in this game. Alright, what if I... Just do this. Oh, well, that added something to it, I think. Judging by the noise. Yeah, because that's a completely different sound. Alright. At least it gives us something to do till Mist shows up. I really want to go explore town, but I don't know if I'm meant to. Also, don't want to waste all these resources. in my mailbox. Anything interesting behind my house? Alright, just some trees and flowers. Is there any sort of forage over this way? First off, let's switch back to my hoe just in case. What's this say? Tauros Cave. Unauthorized entry prohibited. Food to a world where four vegetables might survive. So what happens if I go into a cave without permission? Alright, stuff it. We're going to town. I'll be back in time for lunch. Paris? That's the hospital? That's a bookshop, maybe? Should go into some of these stores. Potion store. The in weapon store. Ooh. Ah, the beach. What is that? Bet that huge seashell surprised you. It sure did. Um, who are you? I'm Sabrina. I run that sea seaside shack over there. My name's Marco. Oh, you're the one Mist caught hold of. Huh? <laughs> Don't worry. Mist isn't a bad person. Anyway, that mysterious shell over there is connected to other worlds. Apparently you can exchange messages and items with people from those other worlds. But don't ask me how. I never figured it out. <laughs> if you want to. Feel free to try it out. See you around. Okay, so that's the internet interconnectivity. I'm not going to explore much further because let's go back and see what Mist has to say. Because I do feel like she's likely to give me a tour of town. I don't want to preempt that too much by knowing where everything is. So let's go see if she's awake. It's 11 o'clock. I don't know what time lunch is in this universe, but should be sneaking up on it, right? Hello, Mrs. House. Good morning. Hi, Marco. What can I do for you? I want to talk. Marco, I really feel that you have the powers of an earth mate. Okay, is that good? And if Earthmates summon monsters, is that something I really want to be? Alright, I can't go through her bookshelf. Alright, maybe I am just meant to explore on my own. Games were a lot less hand-holding back in these days, so... Alright, we'll give it till midday, um, and then we will see if, if if she's got something new to say or if it's just about farming, um, and if not, we're going to go explore for ourselves. I feel like if I wasn't recording this, I would already have been into every store in town. Marco? Hey, Mist. 
I bought you a present. I'm afraid it's radish seeds again. Oh, thank you very much. So them in a field, flow by a cloud by a home. Order them and you'll be able to ship them in five days. The ship put crops in that shipping box and the rosette and rosetta from the store will pick them up once a day before 5 p.m. I explained this before, but key to life on a farm is to earn money here. Okay, I got it. You didn't explain that at all, but okay. Don't forget to water your crops once a day. Nothing will grow if you don't. Okay, I gotta go now. Good luck. She may be a little strange, but she's not such a bad girl. Oh yeah, you don't need to water the crop when it rains. A small consolation when the weather is bad. Okay, yep. Yeah, we're just gonna go explore for ourselves. Maybe not just a little. She is strange. I am okay with that. There you go. Stand in the middle. I am kind of glad that I held off though, because... I don't know. It just feels appropriate to now be on my own after all these gifts of seeds. The more seeds we water, the more money we're gonna make. The more money we make, the quicker we can start doing stuff. Now, let's go find that weapon store again. I want a sword. So we will start with weapons and work our way across. Hey, I can forge anything you want. Hello, Leo. No, Leo, I don't want a hoe. I want a sword. Hello, Camus. A sword, I. So, what kind of sword do you want? A sword like Grimoire's sword. Grimoire's sword? Well, it ain't easy to get hold of. And even if you did, you wouldn't know what to do with it, eh? You can't say that before I even tried it out. I know. Without seeing you swing it, you got no experience and you're full of fancy ideas, Camus. You sound just like my dad. All you old funny duggies are the same. What? What did you say? Nothing. I'm off. So, Camus, who are you? Where'd you go? Right, let's talk to Leo. Hmm. Not seen you before. I'm Leo, I. What be your name? My name is Mako. Mako. I keep forgetting the pronunciation of the name I chose. Hmm. Come over here if you ever need a hoe or a sword forge, and I. Thanks. I will. Can I have a sword? Show me what you have. Eight hundred gold for a sword. For a two-hander. Ooh, we get spears. Nice. Really big hammer, axe, shield. That's it. You got no tools? I don't have a hammer. You got business here? Yeah. Can you forge me a hammer or an axe? Oh, sickle. Axe. You don't have an axe. How am I supposed to forge an axe when you don't bring me one, eh? Alright, so I'll have to bring him... Oops. He is not a run button. Alright, so he's gonna be how I upgrade stuff. Can I just steal one of your axes? No, that's not a very earthmate way of doing things. We're not thieves. We stop thieves. And everybody else, apparently. All right, let's check out the inn. Hey, Xavier, wash your face now. You too, Tori. Quickly. Hello, Lady Anne. What is it? But uh, I'm going to Carmite Cave right now, so I have no time to wash my face. I'm going to go to Carmite Cave. I washed it three times already, Mommy. I'm off to the library. 
those kids of mine. What? A customer was here? What if they saw me flapping about? Hi. You're an unfamiliar face. Traveling through these parts? You're welcome to stay at my inn if you'd like. Thanks, but I already have a place to stay. Oh, it's you! You're the one living with Mist, right? That's right. My name's Marco. I'm Lady Anne. I have a son and daughter about your age. I'm sure they'd love to meet you. They just walked past me. Alright. Nobody else seems to be cruising about. I'll go check upstairs. Oh, these are interesting to rooms. Okay. I really hope I find that wrong button soon. <gasps> Found it! It's R. The R shoulder button. If anybody else is playing this game, that is how you run. How much RP will running burn? I feel like for some of my maneuvers, walking is going to be a better idea, but. Ah, oh, that takes a burden off. Let's see what's in the alchemical shop. Pub Spring Rabbit. Open 12 pm to 11 pm. Closed Mondays. Ah, oh, and it's Monday. The sign that says. Okay, line those up here next. Ah, oh, this will be the general store. Rosetta, should I put it here? Hello, you. What? Daddy, those ones go here. How many times do I have to tell you? You'd be lost without me. Oh, hello. I don't think I know you. I'm Rosetta. What's your name? I'm Marco. It's a pleasure to meet you, Marco. What are you, where are you staying? I'm staying at Miss Farm. What? That old rundown place? Oh, so you're the one she suckered into staying with her. What do you mean, suckered? Let me guess. She told you, I think you have a talent, right? How did you know that? I know, because that's what she says to everyone. Well, I didn't have anywhere else to stay, so I'm grateful she took me in. Since you're staying at the farm, you could probably use some supplies. My house is an item shop, so feel free to stock up on things. Thanks. Oh, and I'll go pick up the shipping boxes at your house, Marco. I'll come by at 5pm on weekdays, so be sure to fill up the boxes by then. Okay, can I leave stuff in overnight? Good day, stranger. You're not from these parts, are you? No, my name is Marco. A pleasure to meet you. I'm Jean. Jean? Jean? Let's go Jean. If you have any, if you need any supplies, feel free to have a look at my wares. Thank you. Say, so where are you staying at, Marco? I'm renting a farm outside of town. Oh, sounds like Mist has a hold of you. <laughs> is something the matter with her? No, of course not. Just a bit strange is all. Sometimes it's hard to figure out if she's being serious or just spacing out. Oh, yeah, I think I know what you mean. Alright, so how do I look at your wares? Come on in. Show me your wares. Thanks for coming as always. Spring seeds and goods. Ooh, special goods. Uh, let's look at spring seeds, because I need to be making money. 200! There's some radishes! Yeah, okay, I need to be making some money. Stop watering things, start running. Oh, I got a skill up for watering stuff though. Uh, this is the hospital. I'm going to spend a lot of time here because we know I'm not going to come back. Hello, Lara. Goodwin, what? I'm just a little tired, Lara. Uh, Dr. Edward. Yeah, you really do seem tired. Being the man must really take it out of you. Look after yourself, okay? Hello. Lara, fetch me the usual nutrition drink, could you? Okay. Thanks, Dr. Edward. You always help me out. And not just that, everyone in town is thankful you came here. When I came to this town, I finally 
felt like my true self for the first time. I believe that it's vital for us to live in harmony with the Earth. I'm the one who should be thankful. I'm so happy to hear that. Okay, that's it for today. Take care. Go say hello to our healers. I haven't seen you around these parts before. Are you a traveler? Yes, my name's Marco. I'm Ed. I'm the town practitioner. If you're not feeling well, come see me right away. Okay. Hello, Ed. My name is Lara. I'm a nurse. Nice to meet you. I'm Marco. Hey, you're the guy who came to Miss Farm. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you? I'm starting to get a little bit concerned by this. It's hard working on a farm. Don't push yourself too hard or you make life. Stop watering the floor, Ronan. Alright, let's go see what's over here. This will be the library. So many scenes. Newman. Don't you get fed up being surrounded by books all day? Books are a source of knowledge. I really do love my job. Oh, Russell. Perhaps you should read a book sometime. <laughs> <laughs> I use a cockadoodle as my alarm clock to get up early and start working. I prefer it that way. Okay, sorry to disturb you, Russell. It was a nice distraction for me. Okie dokie, so some of the town are a bit elitist. Hi, my name is Russell. I'm the head librarian here. Who are you? Hi, I'm Marco. Nice to meet you. So you must be the one who came to Miss Farm. Word really gets around really, really, really quickly in this town. Yes? We also sell books here at the library. We have a variety of interesting titles, so please drop by now and then. We also carry magic books, although they don't come in as often. You'll find them on the back shelf. Magic will be helpful. Hello. Tori. H hello. I I'm Tori. I, I work at the library. Hi, I'm Marco. Oh, so you're the one who came to Misty's farm. That's right. I thought so. Will you be in town long? I'm not sure yet, but I'm in no hurry to leave. I see. Well, I look forward to seeing you around. Thanks! Alright. Read books. Magic books aren't in yet. Okay. What else we got? I'm never going to remember all this in one go. Um, somebody's house. 3pm to 11pm. Open all year. Alright, so a bit early for hot springs. So, you've come to buy something. I'm looking for Nicholas. Did he come here? No, I didn't see him today. Right. Okay. Sorry to bother you. Sabrina. What is it? Oh, nothing. Come again when you need something. Aww. Yeah. Can I help those two get together? Hello, random person. Felicity. Nice to meet you. I'm Felicity. I'm helping out at Newman's store. Nice to meet you too. I'm Marco. Ah, you're the one who came to Miss Farm, eh? It's all over town. So it seems. It must be hard to lose your memory. I hope you can get it back soon. Oh, you've told everybody that as well, Mist. Hey, never seen you before. My name is Newman. Tame the monster and you can get eggs from it. My name is Marco. I'm renting a farm here at the moment. <laughs> You're the one that came to the fabled Mist's place. It's nice to meet you. Oh yeah, that place of yours is cramped and falling apart, eh? Let me know if you need any home improvements. 
I'll make a home from that house. Alright, so you're my carpenter. Jump water in the floor, right in. That's an empty block. That looks like it goes somewhere important. I'm different from my father. Oh, are you just jealous? That way of thinking isn't going to help you become a success even if you go to the city. Okay, I got it. You're saying I'm naive. Yes. A man sees something through to the end before speaking of his dreams. Hey, Ed. Hello, Camus who wants a sword. Are you a traveller? I'm Camus. I run a farm here. My name is Marco. Nice to meet you. Oh, you're the one Miss got her clutches on. Uh... Yeah? She's a real character, isn't she? Don't worry, she's not that bad once you get used to her. Okay. On the bright side, Miss Farm is pretty big. Take good care of it. Okay. And yeah, if you plan on catching any monsters, you'll need to build some monster huts. If you want any build, just let me know. I'm pretty good at it. Okay. Monster hut building. Ordering more floors, cause that's all I know how to do. Maybe I can help him get a sword, teach him how to swim. This is probably a church. Definitely a church. Where's my holy book gone? Hello, Wesley. Hello, Nicholas. I don't know. I don't know either, Cecilia. The I'm pleased you're happy. But I wish you wouldn't play such tricks. Alright, so as ever, we've got some rambunctious children running around. My name is Wesley. I'm a priest of the church. My name is Marco. How do you do? It's very nice to meet you. I hope to see you at the church on holidays. Thank you. Right. Let us pray Let's together pray. today. Do I have a choice? Sun gates. Oh, the other end it was a moon. Interesting. And so it's just a couple of houses there. Alright, looking at how long I've been recording for, we might actually save those for next episode. Head back and turn in for the evening. Gonna have to work out the balance on these days. I'm wondering if they'll speed up as I sort of get further in. But for now, I'd say that has been a very good introductory episode. Next time we'll visit the rest of the houses. Hopefully we'll make some money and uh, get this story really rolling. Until then though, this is Ronan Tears signing off and I'll catch you in the next one.